Hello students, welcome to Sora Sir's classes. In this video, I will be solving some of the geology questions from JAM 2017. Now, in the previous video, I have solved up to question number 27. So, in this video, I will start solving with question number 28. Now, here we have a sand stone that has less than 5% matrix. The recalculated bottle composition of feldspar quartz and rock fragments are 45%, 35% and 20% respectively. Then how the sandstone would be classified as? Now the correct answer of this question is option number C that is lithic ercos because lithic sandstones Lithic sandstones are the sandstones with a significant significant that is less than five percent component of lithic fragment component of lithic fragment. True. So this lithic sandstone, they have significant that is less than five percent component of lithic fragment, and though it has quartz and feldspar. It also have clay matrix. So it also has clay matrix and Arcos sandstone. Arcos sandstone. They are rich in feldspar, that is, they contain at least. 25% of feldspar so the uh, uh, these two we can say that the sandstone is classified as lithic arcos as it contains significant that is less than 5% component of lithic fragment along with clay matrix and it has more than 25% of feldspar so this uh, sandstone uh, is classified as lithic arcos now we will move to the next question that is match the earth layers so these are the earth layers and we have to match it with their corresponding thickness now the crust the crust and the upper layer upper layer of the mantle together together they make up a zone of they make up a zone of rigid brittle block brittle rock called lithosphere and the corresponding thickness of lithosphere is 100 kilometer so it is p and 4 now next is mantle next is mantle now mantle is the layer located directly under the sima so it is located located directly under the sima directly under the sima under the sima and it is the largest layer of earth and it is the largest layer of earth so its thickness is around 2900 kilometers so it's q one next is outer core next is the outer core which is consist of melted metal nickels and iron so it is consist of melted metal nickels 
metals nickels and iron nickel and iron and its corresponding thickness is 2250 kilometer so outer core is around 2250 kilometer and the last is inner core and its corresponding thickness is around 1200 kilometer so the correct answer is option number a now let's move to the next question so in this question we have to find out the pressure and the temperature at the center of the earth now the correct answer is option number C that is the pressure is of 360 GPA where 1 GPA is equal to 10 K bar and the temperature at the center of the earth is estimated to be 6000 K. So the correct answer is option number C that is the pressure of 360 GPA and the temperature of 6000 K or Fahrenheit is the temperature at the center of the earth that is estimated to be